Hey Canter, welcome to my channel. So today I have a collective message. We're gonna find out what we're wanting to hear. Please remember this minute resonates name for every Canter. So let's get straight into this and find out what we're wanting to know. Okay, so I'm getting, okay, whatever this is that you're going through, Cancer, feels very painful, okay? For some of you, um, there's something that came to an end, um, this also could have been some type of betrayal. I'm getting that. There's an energy where somebody may have betrayed you and maybe a friendship came to an end, maybe a partnership came to an end, but it feels like something came to an end. I'm getting that you may have trusted somebody with a secret or it feels like somebody has betrayed your trust it feels like yeah something definitely ended here right there could be a, um, a period of healing going on at the moment cancer I'm definitely getting that there's a very vicious energy here right I'm getting that, yeah, somebody really hurt you. This feels like a very strong betrayal. You may have found something out, okay? I keep hearing discovery, so I'm getting that you may have, like, discovered something. You may have found something out. There could be, again, there's this energy of healing at the moment. There's this energy of, because I do see that there is a lot of pain. You may be having a hard time sleeping. You may be having a hard time getting over something. You may be feeling a little bit alone at the moment, a little bit confused, right? I'm getting something about a secret, okay? Um... And now whatever the secret is, it's like you found out about it. And I just need 313, let me know if that resonates. I'm hearing that song, Valerie from um, Amy Winehouse. Let me know if that resonates, right? Could be dealing with a Virgo, could be dealing with a Pisces, could be dealing with a Scorpio or a Leo. Kind of feels like it kind of feels like two people right have turned against you but the thing is um one person there's this one vicious energy somebody that i'm picturing like a snake okay i'm getting this person was planning out coming in between a connection, right, and they did it, and I'm getting that, yeah, you could be getting over this at the moment, kind of feels like two people have betrayed you here, right, Again, there's a lot of disappointment, there's a lot of pain at the moment, there's a lot of healing. But whatever this is, this is like toughening you up, if that makes sense, right? 
this is also causing a major glow up, okay? Like this is a lot of pain, there's a lot of betrayal in this, but this is going to end up causing a glow up. I see you recreating yourself, Cancer. I also see you... There's an energy of you creating a new identity almost. Um, I, I'm getting a very confident self. Um, I'm getting an energy of you putting yourself first, you being the center of attention, you looking really good and you owning it. Right now there's a period of healing. Um, but I do see you... Because I do see that I'm getting that you've kind of lost two people in your life, right? Like, it feels like two connections have ended, right? I'm also getting, um... Wow, it feels like two people have turned against you. And I'm getting that there was some type of secret that they were keeping from you and then you found out, right? And you've lost trust for these people. Again, there's a period of healing at the moment. I don't know, this feels like there's a lot of pain, there's a lot of betrayal at the moment, okay? And... Again, take your time, Cancer, to heal past whatever this is because for some of you this is like something that's very painful and I do see that it's like you've lost two connections in your life and you've also lost the ability to like trust people. I'm getting that... For some of you, you may have been in a relationship with somebody and then you had somebody that interfered in the relationship and they were keeping it a secret or something. And you may have found that out for others. This is just like two friends that have turned against you. But... It feels very, very painful. Like, I'm getting that you feel left out. You feel betrayed, right? Make sure that... Can I just think 818? Make sure that you guys are working on your heart chakra. If this is resonating for you, make sure that you're working on your heart chakra, okay? Because I do see that whatever this was, this was very painful. And I do see that you're finding it hard to trust people, which is very understandable. And I'm hearing Isabella. Let me know if that resonates. It is very understandable, um, but just make sure that you're working on your heart chakra. Make sure that your heart chakra does not close off and affect other relationships in the future because I do see that that is a possibility here. And hard as it may be, um, make sure you're working on your heart chakra and forgiving the people that have betrayed you for your own good. Because otherwise it will weigh heavy on you. It will affect future connections, right? And, you know, whatever the situation is, you know, shouldn't have the power to affect any other connection, right? Or your happiness.
I do see that being two people, okay, that have turned against you, they're going to end up regretting it, especially one of them. Okay, so as I said before, there's a very vicious energy here. The other energy, which could be a Pisces um, or a Leo, doesn't have to be, but this other energy here, they're going to really regret turning against you and betraying you. This person kind of feels embarrassed. They feel like they've made the wrong choice. Um, and it's like this person is hurting because they feel like they've hurt you. But again, they've made their bed. That's what I'm hearing. And I'm getting that, you know, you, again, it could have been a relationship and you may have given a whole lot of love in this relationship, Cancer. But the thing is, this person that did this to you, you're going to end up finding somebody that makes you so happy that this happened because I see that whoever this is, they were very immature, very, like, self-centered, also very, like, there's a very dictating energy to them. Also a very, like, dishonest and unloyal energy to them. I see somebody in the near future coming in that is very, very open with their emotion. And with the Queen and King of Cups, this feels like a, like a match, right? This is somebody that literally matches you, okay? You guys have a lot in common, okay? You both seem to be very loving and sensitive, loyal people. I'm getting that you have something in common, okay? That really... I'm hearing nationality, you guys. Maybe the same nationality. I'm hearing Greek, okay? You may be Greek. I'm also getting something about Italian and Dominican, so let me know if that resonates. But I do see that it's like you may be single for a little bit, okay, and focus on healing in this time because somebody in the near future is coming in and they're going to be offering you a whole lot of love. This person is very mature. They also know what they want and they definitely have their eyes on you. This person seen you before and well like it's like you may have seen this person around and maybe never spoken to them but they've had their eyes on you right I'm getting this energy, for some of you, you know, you may be going through a breakup and again, you've, this feels like a massive betrayal guide, to be honest. Um, and this feels very painful, but I do see that. You have, like, people that have been waiting for you. Whoever I'm speaking to, I'm getting that you've been in a relationship and now that you're single. It's like you've had people that have been waiting for you, right? You've had people that literally have been waiting for you to be on, you know, single. Um, a lot of earth here. It's like you have two earth signs, okay? That have been waiting for you. Could be like from the same family. I'm getting. Right. They don't take somebody else here. That's waiting for you. But this person seems to be a player. And I just think. 1441. Like this person seems to. Um, they're very attracted to you. But they seem to. Like flirt with people for fun. Like they're not very serious. This other person. This person could be a, a fire sign. 
could be dealing with a Sagittarius as well. I'm getting that even though this is very painful, whatever this is, okay, this feels very vicious, okay, it feels very, even though it's very painful, guys, I do see that it's going to help you find your confidence because you're going to realise your worth, you're also going to have um, a glow up, you're going to meet people that it's like these people are not good for you. Going to meet people that love you, that care about you, right? That treat you the way that you're supposed to be treated. I know, I feel like whoever these people were, they were very karmic, okay? And it really feels like especially if you were in a relationship it really feels like you know you were doing a whole lot for this person even if it wasn't a relationship it just feels like you do a whole lot for people in your life you know you really go out of your way to make people feel comfortable to care for people to make people feel at home it's like you have nothing but good intention for people around you cancer and these people that have betrayed you, they they don't deserve to be in your life, to be honest, okay? And they're getting replaced with way better people, right? People that love you for who you are and care about you and are not going to betray you, hurt you. And, you know, people that you can trust, okay? People that are genuinely going to love you, care about you. And again, people have been waiting for you to be single. Whoever this is, okay, especially if it's a relationship, they messed up big time. And they'll be back. They'll be back. Oh, they'll be back. They made a massive mistake and it's like, this person, it's like they're drowning in regret. But I'm getting that whatever this is, this is going to make you literally... Into your empress energy or your emperor energy, right? So again, just focus on your healing. Don't let your heart chakra shut off, okay? Remember that just because these people hurt you doesn't mean everyone's going to hurt you. Remember these people are karmic and they don't deserve you, okay, Cancer? That's all I have for you. If it resonated, let me know. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video.